If you'd like to do this question alongside me, just click the link below to download and print the template. Then you can stop the video whenever you need to to catch up. So the question asks us to enlarge shape A by scale factor one third from center negative seven, negative five. The first thing I'm going to do is to mark on the center of enlargement at negative seven, negative five. And now I'm going to draw guidelines from the center through each vertex or corner of the triangle. And these will help me to verify that my transformed shape is in the correct position. Now, this is a scale factor enlargement of one third, which means that even though it's called an enlargement, the new shape will be actually smaller. It will be one third of the size of shape A, but it will also be one third of the distance from the center. So it will end up around here somewhere and be one third of the size. In order to transform the shape, I transform each of the vertices in turn. So I I'm going to count squares across and up so that I can divide each one by three. And to help me remember how many I've counted, I'm going to write them down and then divide by three. The first vertex is three, six, nine, 12, 15 across to the right and three, six up, 15 to the right and six up. If I divide both of those by three, I get five across and two up. So I go five across and two up, and my first vertex is here, and that's on the guideline, so I'm confident that I've got that one correct. Um, the second vertex here is six across, and six up. So six across and six up becomes two across and two up when I divide by three. And that means the new vertex is here, also on the grid line. And the third vertex up here, well, I know this is 15 already. So 15 across. And then I've got to go three, six, nine, twelve up. So dividing those by three gives me five across and four up. So five across and four up is here. And then I just need to join the vertices to make the new shape. Now you should be able to see by eye that that's the same shape as this triangle here and it just looks like it's been slid down getting smaller and smaller as if you were viewing it from here and that one was further away from you than that one. Um, if you want to check whether the enlarge enlargement is correct you need to check that each of the sides or one of the sides at least on the new shape is one third of the sides on the old shape so this is six units high divide that by three this is two units high 